Hello everyone, this is Undead, and today I want to do a commentary about what I think about this game is so far. So here's my thoughts, you know, I just recently prestige, I'm prestige 1, and also this is a very great game. I, th I think it's the best out of all the Call of Duties. It's just like Call of Duty 4 and Monster 2 combined. But, um, here's some things that I don't like about it. The spawn system just sucks. So I get shot right here, and I kill this guy, right? I pick up his dog tags, and I keep running. And then I go and I'm trying to look for someone. So I thought, okay, I'm going to turn to my right. And he's right there. When I was out of the way. And uh, guess what? He's right there again. I, I killed him three times. Three times I killed him. If anyone needs to fix your spawns. Now, um, I'm going down this uh, cliff up here. And I turn to my left. And guess what? There's three people. And guess what I get? Triple! I get a triple kill. And then I get another kill after that triple. If anyone needs to fix their spawns, they said that they're going to fix it and so that um, they're going to make you spawn away from people, you know, not in the combat. Well, they did, they did a horrible job because I'm spawning next to people. I'm spawning, like, in front of people and behind people, and the people are doing that to me the same, too. And I don't even, I don't even know how I did not win that gunfight. So, um, they just need... If any word you just need to fix your spawns, please. Now, my other um, thing I don't like is that overpowered weapons, as you may know, the Titan 95 is a pretty overpowered weapon. It has one of the best gun sets in this game, and it's you can get it at level 30. It's just like the G11 off of Black Ops. Uh, the Black Ops, it had a uh, high magazine size, 48, and... It can pretty much one shot burst anyone short to long range. Now, they Black Ops they did patch it, so it's still pretty decent at before the patch. But if anyone were using to patch this gun, this gun shoots faster than a G11. It pretty much has a little bit more damage than a G11, and you know you can put optics on it. Other than a G11, you couldn't. And then the other gun. The FMG 90 Kimbo, that gun is overpowered too. FMG 90 Kimbo has like very high rate of fire and it has like a high magazine size of 36. You can get this gun at level 1 and people just work their way up using that weapon level, like get a weapon level 5 and then they're just done with it and that's the secondary for the rest of the game. I don't see people using a pistol, I don't see people using anything. Other than the FMG 90 Kimbo. Maybe it's an MP9, but FMG 90 Kimbo, that's all I see. So, in favor words, just please patch this gun. You know, just patch it for the Kimbo where you like weaken the damage a little bit. And then the single one, you know, don't do anything to the single one. I think it has too much recoil, anyways, and it's hard to control, so just, just please. Now, what I really don't like is I don't like people sitting in a corner for five minutes straight in a game using Blind Knight and Assassin. You don't do that. Assassin and Blind Knight, you're supposed to stay off radar and not get shot by a helicopter and you're supposed to run and gun with that. You're not supposed to sit in a corner for five minutes waiting for people to walk by you. And that's what people, like, that's what majority of people do. Why do you do it? Like, is it because you want, like, a high kill death? Is it because... You want, I don't know, like kill streaks? I, I don't know. And you're supposed to play it like uh, uh, Rambo. Yeah, you're supposed to play it like Rambo. You're supposed to run and gun. This is what this game's made for. It's supposed to be for fun and and not camping in the corner for five minutes. Now, what I like about this game is that um, the quick swimming is back. MSR sniper rifle is the best sniper in this game. In any other Call of Duty, it you can one shot people in the leg and they'll die. It's better than intervention. Like I barely get any hit markers. And the MSR sniper rifle, I, I just love that gun. The quickscope with it's so much fun. I just love how quickscoping's back. Yeah. Um, I like how this game is. You know the kill streaks aren't overpowered like they were in Monster 2. There's more kill streaks now, and most of them you know suck. Like the strat run, that, that kill streak sucks. The uh, AV Overwatch, I think that's what it's called, the nine, nine kill streak. It sucks. It's like a um underrated attack helicopter. 
uh, you know, the kill streaks are more balanced. I like that. And the kill streaks are more balanced in this game. I just love this game now. You know, it's better than Black Ops and better than Monster 2. Now, the gun on gun fights, it's just like Call of Duty 4. I love it too. You know, Call of Duty 4, you know, it's really fun just running around, just killing people with your gun. Other than kill streaks, you know, it's everyone had the same kill streaks. It's fun just running around and killing people with your gun and like weapon and I love the weapon levels too. Like the cake proficiency, like all the guns have recoil now and it's just great because people can't like snipe you like have across the map anymore. Well they can, but it's gonna be like a lot harder. And a lot more ammo. So I like that too. And uh in this gameplay I go thirty two and eight, you know. It's not my best gameplay, it's pretty much my minimum best. And I want to show you guys the triple kill in this video to show how bad the spawns were in this gameplay. And spawns are really, really bad. Thank you guys for watching. You know, the video is winding down, so have a nice day, guys. These were my thoughts on Mario for 3. Yeah.